built a movement. We won an election. We won an election, people. No, but seriously, look, what comes next is critical. What, what, in many ways, getting here today was the easy part. What comes next is essential. I cannot, we cannot do this alone. Right, we can't. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Severin. The movement that we built must continue to grow. It must continue to demand that San Francisco's district attorney's office makes this city safer for all of us. It must, it must demand that San Francisco make it easier to get help than it is to get high on our streets. It must demand that we stop using the jail as the primary place to treat people suffering from mental illness. It must demand that we test every single rape kit that we built The movement must demand police accountability. Yeah. Ending racial disparities at every step of the criminal justice system. A system that works for all of us, not just the rich and well-connected. But listen, we have our work cut out for us. This is not gonna be easy. It's not gonna be easy. The POA is not done. The machine's not done. We have work to do and we need to do it together. Back when we started this campaign, a year ago, remember where we started, a year ago, we did not know what the outcome would be. But we made an intentional, risky decision to be detailed and specific in our policy proposals. It's not what everybody advised us to do. It's not what the other campaigns did, for obvious reasons, because the attacks the POA pushed out over these last two weeks were all based on specific, concrete proposals that we made that we didn't have to make to run this campaign. But we made them for a reason. We made them because I need you. I need every one of you to hold me accountable to those promises. Will you do that? Will you do that? So thank you for the work you've done in the last year. I hope you're ready for the work ahead because I'm gonna need you, I'm gonna need all of you. And we have to build an office like no other district attorney's office in the country. We have to build an office where our number one priority is healing the harm that victims have experienced and breaking the cycle of recidivism by getting at the root causes of crime, by treating people like human beings with compassion, with dignity, by understanding the need to lift up our healthcare workers and our educators to invest in schools and hospitals, not in new jails. And with your help, we're gonna end money bail. and we're gonna stop treating mental illness with solitary confinement. And we're gonna stop putting children in cages. And we're gonna stop using racist gang enhancements and allegations. And we're gonna start investing in our communities, in all of our communities. And we're gonna do it together, and we're gonna do it starting right now. Thank you, San Francisco, thank you, thank you.